Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to make uh, egg keema paratha or you can say beda keema roti. We are beda keema paratha. So the filling which I have used in this recipe that is the keema filling. The same filling which I have used in my last video in alu keema petis. If you want you can watch that video for the recipe of the keema filling. Or I will share the link in the description box too. So for this keema paratha, beda keema paratha, I have taken 1 kilo of uh, maida and uh, in that I am adding salt according to the taste. That's 2 tablespoons of oil. If you want you can use ghee or uh, butter. Here I am using oil. So now without adding water we have to mix salt and oil in the maida. After that, slowly add water and make a dough like this. After getting this consistency, don't add water. Just keep on punching the dough and then make it like this, soft and smooth. Now add oil and cover the whole dough with oil so that it doesn't get hard. Now keep the dough for rest for at least one hour. Now the next uh, thing we want to prepare for this recipe is we'll take four eggs, add chopped onions, chopped coriander leaves. Now we'll season it with uh, some black pepper powder and some salt. Mix it well. After mixing it well, keep it aside. Now after one hour, we'll see our dough. It has become more smooth, more soft. Exact consistency we want for the paratha. Now make small balls out of it, not too small, like this of uh, ball size, the way we make for parathas. So I have made here total 9 balls, in that 9 balls we will make 9 parathas. Now dust a little flour and keep on rolling the dough. Try to roll it bigger and thinner. Do exactly the way I am doing. Stretch a bit from the corners and make it like this. Let it be a little thicker in the middle and thinner in the corners. Now this is the keema filling. I have used the same filling in aloo keema petis. You can see the recipe of this filling in that video. Now the quantity of the filling depends on your wish. If you are making it for the first time, try to add little. Now on that we are pouring that uh, egg mixture we have made. Now we add egg in this mixture for two reasons for binding and for setting the keema filling in its place. Now fold it from the corners like this and for the last corner you just have to add a little water here and then keep it and gently press it not don't press it hard because the corners were very thin it can easily get break.
now heat a pan and add some oil here i have used uh, two tablespoon of oil after heating the oil keep the flame very low and then add the parathas at first you can't keep the flame on high because the egg inside is raw it's still not cooked Now I have speed up the video actually I have kept it like this without touching it for 3 to 4 minutes after flipping it again keep on low flame and keep it for 3 to 4 minutes after the paratha is cooked for 3 to 4 minutes on both sides on low flame now keep the flame on medium add some oil if it needed if not don't add it now flip it over after 3 to 4 minutes again keeping on medium flame it will start turning golden this process takes a little time on frying because of the egg inside and we need to cook the parathas also from deep inside as we have while folding we have four layers inside now keeping on medium flame only we'll have to hold the parathas like that like this so that the corners can get cooked otherwise the corners will not get cooked properly now you can see the corners are getting cooked and turning golden color If you want you can deep fry also but I think that's not needed The whole process of frying will be done on medium flame only first low flame then medium flame otherwise the parathas will not turn crispy it will get burned it will not get cooked from inside Now you can see it is very crispy from outside and the filling the egg is also cooked from inside so that's all for today's video if you like it please do give a thumbs up and share it with your family and friends do subscribe my channel and support my channel so keep smiling keep sharing bye bye